You know her from hit shows like the shopping bags and Anna and Christina's grocery bag. Well, today I'm on Vancouver's west side to check out Christina Matissic's favorite room. Hello. Hello. Christina, we are standing in your beautiful open space, very classic, elegant. Did you have any help or is this all you? I had a little bit of help. I have a couple of friends who are interior designers, mm -hmm. which is obviously really helpful, but I'm gonna take some credit for mm -hmm. it. Yeah, yeah, I had yes. some influence. Yeah, have so, a yeah. couple friends over for a dinner party, maybe chat yes. a bit about decor and then get some ideas. Exactly. Let's start with the kitchen. Okay, I'm obviously really into the white thing. No, I painted the whole house white. The cabinets used to be a maple color mm -hmm. and uh, they were just starting to look a little dated. So I was gonna get them replaced and I was told that I could actually paint them, which is obviously oh. a lot more affordable. I changed the backsplash, um, which was supposed to be whiter than it is, but that's okay. Yeah. I kind of like it, breaks yeah. up the white. I just like it when it's simple, clean. Um, it just feels more relaxing to me. About your dining room, okay. very elegant. Mm -hmm. uh, what, what's the story behind the table and chairs? I saw actually a similar setup at uh, Peridot on South Granville, mm -hmm. um, the store that I often work with, and I wanted something like that. And I was kind of drawn to gray and white as well, so they helped me um, get the table and the chairs. And I was obsessed with getting a glass chandelier, uh -huh. which took me forever to find what I wanted, but I finally found one and it was shipped in. One of my favorite shows that you and Anna Wollner did is Anna Christina's Grocery Bag, where you really took on some difficult recipes. Are you still cooking at that caliber here? Absolutely not. <laughs> no, that was a lot of cooking. I was hoping that the more I cook, the better I would become and the more I would like it. Yes. And that didn't necessarily happen. We tackled some really complex stuff that I would never recommend to the average chef, but I definitely, you know, it was a good experience and I learned a lot of great cooking yeah. tips. And, and it was tricks. a lot of fun for us to watch Oh yeah, you. thanks. Watch my pain. <laughs> <laughs> you're a busy woman, you've got lots on the go, you're mm -hmm. writing, you're working in PR, communications. What do you like to do, say, on a Saturday afternoon in this living room space? You will probably find me horizontal mm -hmm. on the couch <laughs> on a Saturday, yeah. And you have a cute little dog running yes, around? Yes, I do. What's her name? Ruby. Well, no matter what you're doing in this space, it's a beautiful space to relax in, cook in, try to cook in. Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much for the tour today. Yeah, no problem. Thank you for coming. Uh -huh.